Hi everyone, it's Derek here with Gamer Body, and in this video, I'm gonna go over the Lieber Fitness Equalizer Dip Bar Station for you. So let's jump right into the review. All right, everybody, so let's talk about the Lieber Fitness Equalizers. This piece of equipment is a dip bar station that you can use at home or in a gym, depending what you buy it for. Now, some gyms do carry the Lieber Fitness Equalizers. I've seen them in a lot of YouTube videos, but I actually bought them for myself to use at home to do dips, inverted rows, tricep extensions, and stuff like that. So essentially, they really are a dip bar station that have other options that you can use while doing it all at home. All right, so let's go over the pricing for the Lieber Fitness Equalizers for each edition. So number one, I bought the Frank Medrano XL Chrome Signature Edition, which comes in at $129. I did have a discount code at the time, so I think I paid $109 really for it. But if you purchase it right now, it would be $129 buying it from their website or from Amazon.com. So in this case, I would recommend Amazon if you're going to purchase it that way. The second one, which is an all black version of the Chrome edition, so this is just black instead of Chrome, is $119. There's really no difference besides it being all black and not a signature edition from Frank Medrano. Now, if you want to jump down to another signature edition, but this one is three inches shorter by Natalie Jill, this one comes in at $109 and is a pink color that you can get um, from their website in case you want to get a different signature edition, but one that's shorter. And last but not least, we have the regular signature edition, which again is three inches shorter than the XL edition, which comes in a couple different colors. The main one being yellow that is mostly seen throughout all of YouTube and other videos I've seen as well as online and in gyms. So this one comes in at $99 or like $99.98 on Amazon. So quick look at assembly. This was super, super easy to put together. Honestly, it's only a couple pieces. There's two feet, two handle pieces, and then uh, four screws for each of the different uh, dip bar pieces. So these are separate, they're not together. Some are together in different brands, but this one is a separate piece. You get two separate handles. So it took me all of five minutes. All you have to do is attach the feet, teach uh, the handles, and then screw in the four screws on each side. So that's it, and then you're done. So it took me again all of five minutes to put together. All right, so let's quickly go over my top exercises that I use for the Lieber Fitness Equalizers. Number one, we have chest dips, which are my go-to and primary exercise for this as that's what it's meant for. The second one, which is pretty close, is tricep dips. Love to do some tricep dips on them. Um, the next would be inverted rows. So if you wanna work your back out a little bit, those inverted rows are great for this. Um, you can also do inverted bicep curls. A little awkward with it, but not that bad. I use it pretty much weekly to do them, um, but it is a little awkward with how wide they are. So you might wanna use something else for this, but they work pretty well for it. Um, tricep extensions, love doing tricep extensions. They're a newer exercise for me but they are super hard, especially with this, if you do them the right way. And then knee raises, this is pretty common um, to work out your core and get in great shape. All right, so let's quickly go over my pros and cons list, starting with the pros. Number one, it is simple, versatile, and extremely effective. So again, this device can be used for many, many different exercises, and I love using it because it's so simple and easy to set up and just get right into and bang out your reps for each set. Next, it is definitely a high quality dip bar station has perfect grips, as well as a great height for me for the XL Edition. I'm a little under what the recommended was, so they say you need to be 6'1 or greater, or should be 6'1 or greater for the XL, but really I think at my 5'11-ish height, and just under 5'11, that it works perfectly for me for the XL Edition. So if you're 5'11, you might wanna do that as well and buy the XLs. Also, the Libra Fitness Equalizers are really lightweight. This means you can easily just pick them up, take them where they need to go, and place them down, and get ready to do your exercises. Um, I had ones in the past that are really bulky and heavy, but these ones are pretty, pretty light and I can just easily pick them up, get going, and get my exercises done. And then my last one is that it is pretty reasonably priced in my opinion for the, what it is and what I've used in the past with other uh, devices coming in at around $100 even for the regular and then $130, which is a little pricier. But for me, I would buy this in a heartbeat again for that price because they really do provide you all the value here and the quality of the product is the best of the best. It really is. All right, so let's jump into my cons list now. There's not too many here, but I want to go over them as well. So number one, I would like them to remove the screws that you put in and instead just put a locking mechanism. So I had uh, the ultimate dip bar station, if you look that one up on Amazon, they actually just had a little locking mechanism where you just kind of slid on the, 
the pieces to the feet and they just locked into place instead of screwing them on. I actually really preferred that version of how the setup was versus the screws they have to use here. Because now I have to, if I want to take it anywhere and take the feet off, I have to unscrew everything and do it instead of just pushing in the little lock, taking them apart and moving around. So that's one con that I see for it. Not a big one, but it is a con in my opinion. And then number two, I alluded to the price in the first one as being a pro, because I think it is a pro, but it can also be a con for a lot of people. A lot of people are not going to fork over $100 just for a dip bar station or even $130 for the XL edition. So for me, I think it's well worth it because of the quality of this product, but there are many other ones out there that are similar to this if you want to look elsewhere that are cheaper. I just want to say that this is though the best of the best of what I've ever used. So if you really want quality, I do recommend this one over any com competition that I've tried so far. So now who is the ideal person for the Libra Fitness Equalizers? I would say anyone who's really looking to work out at home and get into calisthenics type of training. Now dips I feel like should be in anyone's training honestly because I still feel like dips are one of the best exercises you can do. So if you're working at a gym or at home I really do recommend it. But the best person this is for is someone who is working out at home, needs a piece of equipment that can do multiple things and, get, and wants to get things done quickly, easily and be able to move it around, stack where they need to go and just kind of get it out of the way when they don't need it and then take it out when they do. So that's the person who should really be using the Libra Fitness Equalizers. And my last question that I have is, would I buy it again for myself? As I mentioned before, yes, in a heartbeat I would buy this as it is the best of the best dip bar station I've ever used and because dips are in my top five or so exercises that you should be doing, yes, I 100% would buy this again without question. All right, so that is my review on the Libra Fitness Equalizer Dip Bar Station. Um, so again, I bought the Chrome XL edition. If you want to look at others, depending on your height or where, however you're doing your fitness, um, go ahead and check out those. Some are cheaper than others, but I bought the most expensive one and I would buy it again in a heartbeat. Absolutely love it. And I hope if you do buy it, that you love it just as much. So if you like this review, please like and subscribe to this channel for more reviews and videos just like this one. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Have a great day, everybody. Be fit and game on. All right, everyone. Thank you for watching this video on Gamer Body. If you enjoyed the video and it brought you some value, please subscribe, click that bell icon, and smash that like button. This way, you will be notified each week when I upload a new video regarding fitness, gaming, and being the legendary you. Until next time, be fit and game on.